So, a lot of people often ask me, um, who's my mentor? Who do I look up to when I was growing up? And and until recently, I didn't have an answer for it. Um, I think I, I like to say that I look up to my dad um, as my literally, literally my superhero when I was growing up. Um, he he is a policeman by trade, and he he started the job when he was um, 23 years old, a really really young age, and. Um, since that age, he's been one person who's been extremely discipli disciplined. Uh, has a lot of integrity, a lot of values, and uh, because of that, it's, he's someone that I really wanted to be when I was a child. I want to talk like him, I want to walk like him. I want to literally go to his job every single day with him. I even wanted to wear his uniform to school when I was growing up. When I was in 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 high school, um, my grandfather unfortunately passed away. And we actually went back to our ancestral home in India and for his funeral. And that was the first time I actually saw my dad crying. And that was the first time actually I think he cried in front of my entire family. That really triggered something in me. Like it took me back to that scene from my my favorite Disney movie called Lion King. Brother, help me! And. I realized that long live the king. My superhero also has some kind of weaknesses and this is one of them. He was crying because his dad had passed away and that um, kind of triggered some inbuilt uh, emotion in me also and, and I realized that this might not last forever for me and how I'll react when my superheroes is no longer with me. Since that day I have literally uh, shifted my way of spending my time with my family, my dad, my mom and my sister and I want to be there for him uh, and for them every single, every single minute and I want to do my best to give them everything that I can. Uh, in terms of love, in terms of support, in terms of financial uh, support, everything that I can to make their lives more, um, that, like, make their lives worth living and not because that I need to but it makes me happy seeing them happy and uh, again I've come to terms with the fact that they're not going to be here forever, my superheroes will not be with me forever but I can do everything in this in this lifetime and spend as much time as I can and literally create a photo album full of memories that will stay with me forever.